Videos are an essential tool for businesses these days, but creating video is a time-consuming process, especially when multiple people are involved. Our own team here at Kapwing felt that the process for collaboration was tedious. We were constantly downloading and uploading files between platforms, hitting file upload limits, and forgetting who had which asset. It was hard to keep everybody on the same page, and at the end of the day, we knew we weren't reaching as many customers as we could with our content. That's why we built Kapwing, a collaborative video editor that helps modern teams create better videos faster. Our team's features unite everyone in the creative process with an intuitive editor and a shared workspace where your whole team can create and store projects, edit in real time together, and provide feedback to create professional on-brand content. In this video, I'm going to give you an overview of Kapwing Teams, including how to set up your team, navigate your workspace, the brand kit, and all of the collaborative editing tools available to you. Welcome to the new way to create collaboratively. Let's begin with setting up your team workspace. Head to the homepage kapwing.com and click Get Started. You can either sign up for a new account or sign in to an existing one. When you first log in, your workspace might look something like this, with only one member in it. To invite your coworkers, click on the Add Members button on the top left corner. You can either copy this link and send it to everyone you'd like to invite, or you can invite them by typing in their email addresses here. Click Invite Members and you'll be led to a page where you can review the details of your workspace. Change your workspace name to something recognizable to your team and upload a workspace logo. When you're happy with your workspace details, click Done. You can see whether or not your teammates have accepted their invitation by going to your workspace settings. If you invited your teammates by email, they will receive an email in their inbox with an invitation to join. Your team is now ready to collaborate. Now I'm going to show you how to navigate your workspace. On the left sidebar, you have the option of creating workspace folders. Adding folders will help your team keep all your projects organized so you know exactly where to find them later. In our team workspace here at Kapwing, each one of our teams store projects in their own folders. Some of our teams use multiple folders. For example, our marketing team has a folder specifically for the short form content we post on social media. There are many other ways to organize your team workspace, and it's ultimately up to your own team's needs. To create a new folder, click the folder icon on the left sidebar. Give your folder a name and click Finish. You can create a project within a folder by selecting the folder you want to be working in and clicking Create New Project. This project will be automatically saved into the folder you selected. You can move a project from one folder to another folder by clicking on the three dots to the right of the project name, Move To, and then the name of the folder you'd like to move the project to. BrandKit is an essential tool to ensure that every video your team works on is on brand. To customize your team's brand kit, press the tab on the left-hand corner. There are four sections to the brand kit. Brand templates are a great way to streamline your team's workflow and stay consistent with your projects. To access a brand template, simply click on the template at the top of your workspace. This will create a copy of the template project. For example, this YouTube end screen template is used by our own marketing team when we are editing our YouTube videos. Since we always include this graphic at the end of our videos for 10 seconds, and we always use this subscribe to our channel animation, it is really helpful for us to edit our videos using this template without having to import these two files every time. You can also access your brand templates inside the editor. Go to templates on the left sidebar and your team's brand templates will always be at the top. Any member of your team can create a brand template by heading to the Brand Kit tab and clicking Create New Template. You can also turn an existing project into a template by clicking on the three dots and pressing Save as Brand Template. Brand Media is a library of images, videos, audio files, GIFs, and more that your team needs to use on a regular basis. For example, these are some commonly used images by members of our own team at Kapwing. Now that they are in our brand kit, we can easily access them while working on any project. In the editor, all of the assets in your brand media can be instantly accessed by going to the Media tab and clicking My Media. Anyone on your team can upload brand media by going to the brand kit and clicking on this plus sign. 
Your brand colors and fonts make it easier for your whole team to stay on brand and consistent with every project. Add your brand colors by clicking this plus sign and selecting a color or copying and pasting a hex code. Similarly, add your brand fonts by clicking on this plus sign. There is a large library of fonts to choose from, but if you don't find the font you are looking for, you can also upload a TTF or OTF file here. Once you have your brand colors and fonts set up, you will have immediate access to them in the editor anytime you need to choose a color or a font. For example, when I add text and choose the font, my brand fonts will always be the first options shown. When I change the color of my font, my brand colors will be laid out as options. Without the brand kit, your editor would look something like this instead. Kapoing Teams makes it really easy to keep your entire team on the same page, collaborate in real time, and give and receive feedback. Multiple team members can open any project in your shared workspace at the same time. If your teammate joins you in a project, you will see their icon appear on the top right corner of the editor. Any changes they make to your project will be updated in real time. If their name is highlighted around any object, that means they are currently selecting and adjusting it. Another great collaborative feature is the ability to leave comments directly in Kapoing's editor. You can even indicate the exact timestamp you are providing feedback on. To leave a comment, move your playhead cursor to the part of the video you would like to address. Find the comments button on the top bar and type out what you would like to say. Make sure the Include Timestamp box is checked. Once you leave the comment, a marker will appear in the timeline indicating that a comment has been made there. Your teammates can go through your comments and reply if they need to. And there you have it! A collaborative video editor that helps modern teams like yours make better videos faster. Empower your whole team to record, edit, and design on-brand content together. For more tutorials on Kapwing Teams, check out the playlist linked in the description of this video. Thank you so much for watching, and if this video was helpful to you, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to the channel. Happy editing!